Hey everyone, this is Disc Junkie, and today I'm reviewing the Alien Trilogy, and this is the limited edition Facehugger box set released in the UK back in 1992 or so, and the Alien Trilogy was still just a trilogy. Anyway, before I get into reviewing this, I just want to give a shout out to my man DVD Mike 7 here on YouTube, who was nice enough to help me import this. Uh, found it on eBay, but uh, the seller wanted really high amount for shipping, so DVD Mike helped out by uh, getting this forwarded from his address in the UK. Uh, and it took a couple of days to get here. I was a little bit sweaty. I was really worried that it wouldn't arrive, um, but. Um, it did arrive, uh, just arrived today, just unboxed this, so we'll get a look at it, and it is absolutely stunning, I, I love it, and I've been wanting to get this, I mean, oh Jesus, look, just look at the details, look at how, ah, just look at this, how fucking beautiful is that, just a hard plastic mold, wow. It's sort of hard for you to tell uh, on the video so far, but this set is huge. I mean, look at my hand. This is a VHS box set, uh, and I'm going to show you the insides, and then you'll get a, an idea of uh, of how big the box is. Um, but I've been I've been wanting to get this for a long time. I might check and check this out. See how the tail sort of molds and just you know it's molded around and runs across the back here. Uh, and it's so thick, so the tail actually works as, uh, you know, uh, the box that has these little feet on this side, but the rest of the box is just supported by the tail, so I just, just love that design. Ugh, look at the little tail curl. God, I'm getting angelously, yeah. It's like, it's like jizzing in my pants time, that's what it is. Look at that, you can see and the letters are also sort of embedded into the into the plastic there. Packaging copyright 1993 TCFFC not really sure what TCFFC stands for, but anyway uh, this is obviously made from hard plastic um, it's a little bit softer than I imagined, I mean the, the mold itself is really hard, I mean this doesn't flex or anything, but the larger parts, like this part here, that is sort of soft, you can see that it kind of, it flexes in, you can check the, just check the side here first, you can see you got these little hinges right here, and you got another one on the other side there, and those are the only hinges, now these are plastic hinges, and I've seen quite a lot of copies uh, of this set where the hinges have broken off, so sort of a delicate thing, uh, and but I was really happy to get this because it is absolutely in mint condition, so it's really awesome. And here we got the other side, which has a handle, and there's no real lock on it, it just sort of opens up. Yeah, so first I'm actually going to take these things out and just sort of show you the interior first. So here we got the first three Alien movies. Now these are VHS tapes, obviously. And I'm also going to show you, here you get the top part of the box set, uh, which is also presented in this sort of, you know, uh, it's a molded plastic and it has a uh, space for the making of Alien 3. Uh, and it's special collector's edition. Now I don't know if this making of uh, is exclusive to this edition because I haven't actually watched this yet. Um, next up, we got uh, three of these little pins or buttons. Now, let's see, next up, we got the Alien War Privilege card. And for those of you who don't know what this is, I'm going to move this up close for a bit there. Um, this was sort of an old promotion thing, it was valid at the time of the release. And uh, uh, I can just 
tell you what it is. Uh, this card admits two people for the price of one for an indefinite number of visits uh, and is valid until 31st January 1995. Uh, blah 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 blah. Uh, but it's it's uh, it's a promotional you know offer for um, for something called Alien War, which was in London. And I'm not entirely sure what this Alien War thing was, but I'm sure someone else can fill that in. And uh, just quickly before I move on, just gonna pick up these tapes to show you what it looks like beneath. Uh, these are actually you know it's plastic mold. And these tapes are actually, you know, they're, they're like perfectly fitted. Um, it's quite a tight fit for the cases, so you really have to sort of jiggle them out. But, you know, it's tight, but not too tight. So it won't damage them, but, you know, the upper tape, they won't fall out and stuff. So let's just check out the covers a bit quickly. We've got Alien 3. There's a back cover. Then we got the special edition of Aliens, which still has the part of the shrink plastic on actually, it's really nice. And then we got Alien. I knew I went in reverse on this, but still. Yeah. I just generally I just think it's a very nice design. Um, just you know the coherence and it looks like sort of a luxurious design. Like one of those old school classic things, you know, simple, all black, stylish, and then you do know, these uh, simple three squares individual colors of like green, blue, yellow. It seems like one of those old school designs that looks really good but might not be something that you see typically these days. Um, I can also, before I just go into the other stuff, I'll show you the Alien, the the making of Alien 3 tape. Alright, so here we go. It's the cover of Alien 3, the making of. And there we get the back cover. I would really like to see this because I think it's it says here exclusive behind the scenes footage and interviews with Sigourney Weaver and the alien creator H.R. Geiger. Uh, but that's pretty much the box set. Uh, but as you remember there were some other stuff in here. I'm gonna show you what they are. We got a bit of uh, probably like uh, sort of like lobby cards I would assume. So we'll just, let's just flip through these real quick. These are all beautifully printed, actually. Uh, they're not glossy, they are matte, but uh, nevertheless, it's a really, really nice set of images, if you ask me. Here is a collector's certificate for this. So this set is actually numbered and this is limited edition number 05371. I can't actually remember how many copies it was produced in. Um, but I'm going to look into that so you can check out this junkie.se and I'll try to get the details. Let's see, I wonder if there was a backside to this. No, they're all white. Next up we got a Alien Trilogy booklet, really major booklet actually. Just gonna flip through this as well. In space, no, I can hear your screen. Uh, I'm just flipping through this quick because you know I don't. It sort of takes up a lot of time doing this video, so I'm gonna try to speed things up. Wow, it's really nice. And last but not least, this is a pretty important detail didn't show this before um, because it doesn't actually fit into the into the box set itself but this was something that was included originally um, but it's very unusual to actually have this when you buy the box set you know if you get it second hand these days this is something that is almost always uh, missing from a box set and this is an exclusive t-shirt which was only presented in this box so this is an Alien Trilogy t-shirt, limited edition, uh, the back side is all black. But yeah, thanks to DVD Mike 7 be sure to check out his channel, 
But anyway, that's it for me today. Hope you all enjoyed this, and I'll see you all next time.